So this is just a whole... that was used to grind grain and it was in here so if you're new here this is a series where I go to every town in Morris County New Jersey and try and get three photographs for a project that I'm gonna do later so these were two grindstones used to grind the grain which is fun to say but essentially what that means is that it would take the grain and grind it up into smaller pieces using the stones so this is just a whole under road, which is really cool looking. And there's graffiti, which is awesome. So this is the back of the mill, the actual mill part. And as you can see, the water would come over here and then go to this wheel, which would spin and then make the entire mill turn. And below it, there's a nice pool of water in case you want to accidentally slip on all of the mud. If you look at the way as the things go down, it gets like you can see further and further into it. I want to get a picture with that, so let's see how it came out. So obviously the mill is where this river used to flow when they diverted it. But now that it's back, the water's actually really high. But as you know, Rivers in broad sunlight kind of sucks, but mushrooms don't. So the broad sunlight sucks, but let's talk about how you get good pictures early on. Because if you've been looking at any of these vlogs, you'll see that most of the pictures that I take in the beginning aren't the ones that I end up using. But a technique that we like to use a lot is warming up beforehand. Let's show you how to do it. There's a crack in the glass there. I thought that that was pretty cool. So. I guess it came out nice. But if you look, you'll see this beautiful hand pump well. That's actually just a normal well. Well, well, well. It, that wasn't funny. Let's, let's just go to the next place. So we got the gimbal on, which is amazing. So I can just hike up and down and it keeps focusing on me. If you're into filmmaking, even if you're just using your phone, get a gimbal, it's amazing. So the trail we wanna go down is closed. So we'll just see what we can see, I guess. Kinda sucks that the trail wasn't open, but like, it's not even a great day to be taking pictures of the woods anyway. So like, who cares? Waterfall trail. I guess we might be able to see it after all. But if you're seeing it now, that means that we are, because I'd probably cut this out if we aren't. So Hackleburnie is the state park we're in right now. It runs along this river. And this side that we're on right now is in Chester, and then that side is in Washington Township. I think so, I don't know. I done? Did you double click it? No. You totally did. Thank you. It worked. It like fades out, right? When it takes a picture? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're recording. You definitely did. You've been recording for a minute and 13 seconds. So warming up is mainly done by just taking pictures. 
Just like how when a runner warms up, they just run. But before I start shooting, I like to try and just take pictures around my house or around where I live, just like to get used to doing it. And then that helps me get better pictures when I'm out here. Even if you don't end up taking the pictures, if you just look and you see that would make a good picture, that would make a good picture, then you'd be able to get better pictures from the beginning instead of having them look bad. So this is the waterfall and it looks pretty good. So let's take some pictures. So right now we're at Bamboo Brook Outdoor Education Center and it's really quiet. What this place is, oh, the, now there's a dog, not quiet anymore. But what this place is, is a house that was made by some famous landscaper. So there should be some pretty cool gardens and stuff to take pictures of. So it's a cattle guard. And it said not to walk on it, which I was just walking on it and not reading the sign. Breaking laws. Quiet, peaceful, I like it. I don't even need to have my mask on. There's nobody within like a 15 mile radius, which is cool. So that's the house there. And I guess this is just nature. So if you want a nice walk in nature, you can do that. So the house was made, so then there'd be gardens and paths that you could see the actual house from, which is landscaping and that's why it is such a cool landscaping place, I guess. When you're a professional landscaper, your house always looks good. And I can improve that. So if you look really closely right there, there's a drain. So none of these lakes or ponds are real. I think that's pretty cool. Because everything looks so natural, but then you just realize that it's not. So, cool place to be. I've been complaining about the harsh light all day, but this actually looks pretty good in it. That's a sundial, which is awesome. Sundials are cool. Well, it's the day before daylight savings time. So that's the last time that that sundial will be dead on. From Google Maps, it doesn't even look that popular, but how can you not love this? It's so cool. Like seriously, it's so green and pretty. All of it. The lake, the bridge, the house, it's... Uh, it's genius, that's what it is. They made this entire place so you can just see the house or see all the other houses from like everywhere you go and it's so cool. Imagine it though, you're like super rich, you live in this house, right? Or like a house like it that has super cool landscaping. Then you have a second house for your gardener and you're like friends with your gardener, like family. It's like a cheesy sitcom idea basically, but it'll also be kind of cool. So the guys who make the telephone poles, this was the only place in the country where they just put poles and then tested them with different treatments and different types of wood. So it's pretty cool. So I, I guess I'm just wandering around a bunch of telephone poles, which is fun. No one's stopping me. So be sure to like and subscribe. It lets me know that you like the content and that you want to see more. Because I'm standing on a pole for no apparent reason. I feel like it. this is scary. Don't do it. But anyway, like and subscribe. Comment what you want to see me do in the next towns. Have a good one.